From the wee hours of the morning up until the Romney camp conceded defeat, much of China seemed to be on Weibo, the country's version of Twitter, typing away as votes were cast and ballots were counted in the U.S. With their own set of leaders to be announced later this week, the right to vote was not lost on Chinese netizens. Many of the posts were reactions on how Americans got to choose their own leaders. One user quotes Obama's victory speech. We can never forget that as we speak, people in distant nations are risking their lives right now just for a chance to argue about the issues that matter, the chance to cast their ballots like we did today. Then the post concluded, This day of the U.S. elections deeply moved me, and these words were the most valuable. While another one writes, The significance of the U.S. presidential elections may not lay in who is elected president, but for the American people, the course of the country's development is firmly grasped in their own hands through votes. In contrast, many of us seem passive. We always hope an arbiter will appear. Though both were not without their own supporters. For example, one user posts, I think Obama won because his opponent, Mitt Romney, was very subpar. While another writes, Who is better for the U.S. economy? I'd vote Romney. As president, he'd more easily work with Congress to push some of the necessary reforms. The hashtag U.S. presidential election was the top trending topic and hit a one-day high when it garnered over 67 million hits. The Obama hashtag also soared that day, but failed to reach its October 26 high after the final presidential debate on October 22. Romney likewise surged but failed to reach its October 22 high. This is the first U.S. election since massive internet penetration in China, and it's exposed netizens to American-style democracy. It's also led to wide discussion among younger Chinese about its processes and its outcomes. For Link Asia, this is Nicole C. in Beijing. Now on U.S. Airwaves, a global channel of uncompromising stories. World news, documentaries, entertainment, and culture. Link TV, connecting you to the world. For more information, visit linktv.org.